What is up, my crazy of Verconians? My name is Rodico, you can call me V, and welcome back to Jurassic World Evolution. I haven't had to record this in a fair few weeks uh, because of the amount I recorded last time, um, and we're going to try and keep that little streak up. Uh, to do so, I'm probably just going to do a few short episodes to begin with, and then we'll be back into our long episode stints. However, I decided to join back because um, I got a little bit of work done off camera. Ooh, what did we just take? I think we took... I can't... Oh, poop. Um... Um... Uh, I did pick the right one, thank the lord. Right, so, um, yeah, we did a little bit of work off camera, so I did a bit more research, stuck some upgrades on, and waited for some cash to come in, but that was it. Who? Oh, what happened there? What happened there? Wait, what? Our ticket sales went... Oh, the storm. Storm's probably done that. Um, so that's not good. <laughs> As you can see, we lost a lot there. We're going to extract that. So I've been going for Velociraptors because we've got them unlocked. And Tyrannosaurus Rex will be next. We can look to get an Indominus Rex because that's going to be super duper useful. Also, on the research front, I would kindly love to get a better fence. Uh, I need to get three stars for that, however, and that's near good. Right, so you need to be fixed, and then you. And then we'll get you down. Oh, we don't need to get down there yet, just yet. Let's have a look quickly. Wow. what? Ha I think it was the storm. Now that the storm's gone, hopefully we're going to go back up. Let's have a quick look at our rating, actually. So, capacity, uh, satisfaction is still a problem. Um, obviously, visibility. Uh, Thing is, as soon as I put visibility down here, I'm going to need to build more attractions, but that's fine. I can do that. I do want to get another enclosure built soon. Um, what can I make it out of? Let's have a look. So, electrified heavy steel fence. That works. So, we can make a nice little Barry Onyx, I think. That would be quite nice. Bit of variety. And then I could potentially put Trudons in there with them too. That would work quite nice, I think. <laughs> we'll find out shortly, I guess. Uh, it's all in a straight line, and that sucks, but <clears throat> it's kind of what we need to do. That's fine. So, I think I've left enough for a path around there, which will be kind of super duper useful. And I also just broke my cardinal rule of not putting this down first, which is not good. That's fine. Oh, I saw it go blue. Everyone sees it go blue. There we go. Glorious. Now we're going to stick a path all the way around that. And I may have restricted. Let's find out, shall we? Okay, cool. Cool. Perfect. Yes, great. What this allows me to do is put viewing enclosures there and then food here. And that will let me get my visibility up for both. So let's go ahead and get some viewing. Oh, I need to research the viewing platform. Open research. So, yes, you're needed. Gyrospheres, you're not needed just yet. Wait, what? Why are gyrospheres only 51 and that's 512? <laughs> that's not fair. <laughs> Should have read that before I did it. Uh, we need to get three stars so that I can start looking at that. But that's fine, because as soon as visibility is going to go up, that should knock us up a little bit more. This is going to take a while. Um, but when we get one enclosure of an Indominus Rex or a couple, because we'll probably research <laughs> the genetic requirements needed, to make sure that we're all good. There we go, back up to a decent profit. Uh, research, genetic research, where are we? Uh, here we go. So, um, which is the one that allows you to get along fine with other people? So, lowers the comfort threshold. Who wants to do that? <laughs> uh, you want the higher comfort threshold, but that's fine. Um, right. Group adaptation, social requirements by one. Yes. We also need to get these up a bit so that we can start, you know, getting better stats for them. So we'll look at that. We've got three research teams, which means I can do a lot. I did not send my guys out. So back to the Velociraptor place, please. 74% though, which is nice. Uh, Fossil Center, I think you have got upgrades, as does the Expedition Center, I think. Yes, it does. Fantastic. Right. All in all, doing quite well. Let's have a look at our powers quickly. So 80, 0 left, 0 left, 14 left, hmm, interesting, we do need to get another one potentially here. I know I need to build hotels still and a 
you know, transport will need to happen. What I'm thinking is we'll probably get rid of a power station and put a large one down. Let me have a quick look at the map here. We've still got space there for a large one. Uh, and then we're going to start transporting all around. So that's perfect. Research. Oh, we've got re more research possibility now. That's great. I'm going to need to research more of the cures. I'm aware of that. I can't get that till I get to three stars. Damn it. Right. So let's go ahead and get some more medicines. Right. Yes. 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 Oh, I can't. I've got to wait for the viewing platform, but we'll get all the medicines done. So if our dinos get sick, we've at least got a fighting chance of getting them better. Um, grand. Okay. Yes, it's not going poorly, at least. It's going... It's going all right. <laughs> we'll see how, how all right, but it's going all right. Right, okay, so we've made this now. Uh, I've waited for my funds to come back a little bit so we can replenish those poor, poor funds. We can get another enclosure in there quite comfortably. That's nice. Um, and then we want to put in... Ooh, a feeder. So, carnival feeder. We want some water. Yes. Perfect. We're going to want some more trees. So, put some trees there. Fantastic. And then we're going to incubate some baryonics. So, baryonics, what can you get along with? How many? Yeah, no, I can't see you. But if I do it here, I can. So, social. One to two. How about two to three? Sounds good to me, doesn't it? All right, upgrades. Uh, one is 10%. Damn it, right. We need to get more success rate uh, researched. So, that's fine. We can do that. Success rate, so building up rates, and it is the Hammond Creation Lab, so success rate dos. And that works too. And then more of the medical treatments. Fantastic. Fossils. Uh, cool, we've got more. Let's go ahead and send our guys back off then. There we go. You, I'm not going. I can extract and get it out there, but. There's no point, because I'm not going to use it, you know? Um, at the same time, if I extract them, I mean, they're going to be usable, and I could make a mistake, but I'm saving my game often, so I'm going to extract them, just so they're out of the way. We are going to save the game. <laughs> and remember never to use herbivores, because if I do, then we're losing the achievement, because that's what this little challenge mode um, playthrough currently is for, is to get some achievements. And well, the last of the achievements, I've got six achievements remaining, one of which I'm pretty sure is going to take quite a lot of time, or quite a lot of attempts, I should say. Uh, Crimson Sodium Parasite Died Medical Treatment. Glorious. Right, well, we've got more research to do. Uh, da, 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 da. Medical research. So you're next. Less than one minute, so that's fine. We've got three more of those, and we are good. Right. So... I'm going to wait for the next upgrade, because I want to... Let's have a look, actually, incubate the baryonics. How much are you going to cost me? Quite a bit, as it is. And we want to get three of you, so... We're not going to modify you anymore. Are we now? No. That profit's going to dip, but it's never going to get to a problem um, until we have another storm or something like that, but I've built shelters now, because I didn't before. I do need to power a hotel. Are we at any risk? We're at no sabotage risk, and that's brilliant. Though these do give me, you know, sort of monies and stuff, and that's kind of super duper useful, it always will be. I'm still able to go on digs, and we're finding quite a nice amount of stuff. I've got some um, increased dig yield, so that's pretty grand. Right, there we go. Exactly what I was expecting to see. Oh, you're completely depleted, so we're going to go to Velociraptors here. And then look for some Tyrannosaurus Rex. So, Tyrannosaurus Rex. Oh, we're going to go for the one that's only, like, one and two, so we'll go for that one, obviously. Um, let's get to our fossils. Uh, extract, extract, sell, 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 extract. And, oh, I can't extract anymore. Interesting. Is it because I've got too many queued up, or is that because I should have it by there? We'll wait. We will wait. And success rate two is ready. Brilliant. I'm about to get rid of a lot of my buffer, and I do not like that. But... We mm -hmm, kind of have to, so it's fine. Incubation speed, who know? Okay, so 
this is going to bring me more money in and we did get quite a nice little bit of funds actually just before that so we'll wait till we get to another 1.5 million at a minimum before we like invest in a second Barry Onyx actually saying that damn it I've just remembered something I think it's gone up two to three so we need a minimum of two to three now so I can't really even release this guy till we get another one that's fine that is fine yeah two to three minimum that's fine um, oh, actually, while well, I'm there, let's have a look at your uh, grasslands and other requirements. So, 79, sit 504. So, forest, we don't need much, but we need quite a bit of grassland, that's fine. So, Baryonyx, you're coming now. And, oh, I probably could have not. No, I didn't have any cosmetics, that's fine. So, I do want to research some cosmetics then. So, they're going to drop 5% for. Oh, glorious, glorious. Okay, so. Fossil, Baryonyx, any Baryonyx stuff. Nope. Mate. Yep, that's Baryonyx, that works. And then we want to get back and go to get some medical treatments, because, of course, and I'm going to go to our fossils that have just arrived. Extract. Okay, no, it was, I just had too many queued up. That's fine, extract. Cell. Taurosaurus, yes. Cell. Ovi, sell, yas, and sell the Gallimimus. So we got a Tyrannosaurus Rex first fossil, which is great. Uh, I'm not too sure how far into the Velociraptor we're going to get, so we're going to keep just pummeling more stuff in there. Then we'll get back to that little fossil dig where we can get some more T Rex, glorious T Rex DNA to be able to turn into a Tyrannosaurus Rex, and then eventually down the line, an Indominus Rex to go here. I do need to hit three stars before we consider that because of the large amount of risk associated. So that's fun. Transport, actually. How much? Do -do -do -do. So I need to get transport. I need. Where are we? Oh, it's quite a bit of money. But it will be invaluable, I don't doubt. So advanced storm research is obviously the one we go for. We don't need to go for that one. So that's fine. These, I'm not too fussed about. These I will fuss about because we're going to need them to get the five stars. Just trying to get in a nice amount of income at this point in time. And to be fair, we're not that far off on the facility rating. So, you know, we'll work with what we've got for now. In fact, no, let's have a look how much they do cost research wise. Uh, we do want to get some more medical. Well, one more medical done. And that's the last one. The other ones I've gone locked so far, that is. I could get more fossils and stuff, but we, we haven't got much room for um, dinosaurs in this island, so we've got to be very conservative of what we do. Although I could just use them and then replace them, but you know, you're going to cost quite a bit. You're all only 51,000. Okay, so toy shop's good for fun, but so is arcade. I've got the sh restaurant on the clove shop, didn't I? For shopping. Right, that's fine. That works. Cosmetic genes, right? So the next baryonyx that we do incubate, we are going to need to upgrade this yet again. Should have just done this in the first place. So we've gone up to uh, there we go incubate baryonyx modify. You're going to go up in price, but that's fine. Yeah, one point one five. So we definitely need to wait for that one. Um, one point one five. So we need to wait for one point five now, just to be safe. Nope, you can get sold. Oh, I can't sell you, which is not great. Extract, extract. Extract. Right, so we want more Velociraptor. We are at 92%, so it was good to keep going back there. That's fine. I didn't click on it. Damn it! I knew that would happen. And there we go. Glorious. Okay. We can't even release you yet. I'm aware. Don't worry. As much as it's going to... I'm going to get a pool. Like, I'm going to fill a pool to say, Go on, incubate it. Go on. Go on. But I can't. I cannot do it yet. Profits dropping as expected, but it's not going to go much up because this is going to stay stable. So we might drop and drop and drop and we'll drop to a point where we're not making profit unless we screw up badly. But that's what saved games are for. <laughs> Regularly save your games. Obviously it auto saves, but if you want to control the save and you don't want to lose too much progress or it auto saves after a problem, you don't want to do that. Anyway, let's have a look at our rating quickly. So what is suffering? Everything apparently. What happened there? When did that happen? Management view. Storm, that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Food, right. What could possibly 66%, 59%, 70%, 90%, 100%, 
Right, it's just dropped for a short period of time, that's all. Okay, so if we do want to get transport done, we'd have to replace. I'm thinking that small power station, just take it out once we put a large power station in. Speaking of which, can we research that yet? I don't think we can. Buildings. No, we cannot. We can get a substation, but that doesn't count. <laughs> Oh, we need to get the three stars though, and it's more the dinosaurs that are pulling us down than anything else, so just more unique species, I guess. So, fossils, uh, cell, yes, and extract a Tyrannosaurus. Go back for more Tyrannosaurus and Toro. And then more of this, in case we don't get enough. Although, to be fair, I don't think that will be. This, however, is going to get me some of my money back for selling the digs. And we are over 1.5 million, so we can warrant, warrant, warrant um, more Marionixes to be incubated. So incubate, and then we're going to release them when the second one is ready. Uh, if we release it too early, we're going to have a bad time. Just going to have a bad time. <laughs> it's all I'll say, because um, it will get a bit stressed, and we don't want that. Right, research. Uh, that's done. Global operations, right. These cost a small fortune, don't they? Don't want that at this point in time. If I could get any of them, it would be to improve marketing, but that's just going to shoot me in the foot because then we're paying more towards the thing. That could be useful, that would be super useful, and that would be useful, but we're going to have the upgrades available to counter that anyway, so... Um, we can't get any more of you, that sucks. I can get that, but I don't really need it at this stage. I just need to get the three stars, so I'm hoping through the Baryonyx going three out of ten and this potentially taking us over a fifth of the way, we can get a one star, which should hopefully bring us up to three stars, if not two and a half. And then I can start thinking about the Trudon introduction. And then after that, we'll hit three stars, I'll get the better fences researched, and we will save a bit of money and we'll start looking towards an Indominus Rex, which, or a couple of them to be fair. Um, looking at 3,000 there, if we just pummel a lot of stuff into an Anomalous Rex, we're going to be looking good, right? Sell the Gallimimus, yes. Extract the Velociraptor, yes. That's not going to be enough to get us to um, what we want to be, so we need to go for one more, I guess. Yeah, looks about right. And a couple more T-Rex digs. And once that Velociraptor one's done, we can just focus on the Tyrannosaurus Rex, and then I think we can go look at Trudons. Do we don't have Trudons ready yet, do we? A new. Got quite a while before we can get Trudons. That's fine. It's a real big shame that obviously a lot of these guys can't get along with more dinosaurs. Otherwise, that'd be awesome. Um, I think like Velociraptor might be able to get along with. Um, oh, I can have a quick look on the wiki, can't I? You know, or googling it. What gets along with what? But Velociraptors always try and break out, so maybe not. Uh, might be not be worth it. What? Uh, Jurassic Evolution. Evolution. What carnivores get on? Mm, compatible carnivores, that works. Big carnivores with small ones that are real problems. They just run away from the big guys, make sure you can water, blah, blah, blah. I have so far. Um... No, don't put them the same size. Okay, so I'm going to quiet and reading. So basically, you can have them together. Uh, okay, no worries. Oh, it's a bit of a yawn there. It's not even that late. It's not even gone midnight yet, so that's a bit of a shame. Um, oh, we'll have to extract it. Oh, what a waste of good Tyrannosaurus potential. Uh, sell. Sell. Ugh. None of the good stuff there. Not a single thing, right? Oh, Velociraptor hit 100% anyway, so... Of course we weren't. Um, so... Because we could maybe put Dinonychus in one and Trudon in the other. 
I think that might be a good shout. Um, and then that brings up a variety even more. Whoa. And then I can save it. If it goes wrong, we can fix it from there. So that's fine. That works. Um, so anyway, we'll go to Tyrannosaurus Rex for now. There is another one for T-Rex, and it's down here, and it's such a low chance it's not worth it. Cool. These are both ready to be released, so we're going to release them now so we can get more money. <laughs> we can think about releasing a third one once we've seen how happy or not happy they are. Oh, we've just gone up to two and a half stars, which is nice. Come on, show me your stats. Lonely, yep, that's cool. A second one is coming out. That means I can probably warrant getting a third one shortly. Right, we keep going up and down. It's because of this. However, we've still not hit one star. So that's a big, big pain in the butt. Uh, oh, we've hit one star. <laughs> okay, so this is fluctuating a bit too much, but we need dinosaur visibility for um, that. So I can do that. So we're not going to focus about getting another baryonyx just yet. So I'm going to do this here. Then a uh, enclosure. Mm, I feel like that might not have been worth it though. Because look, um, if I build that there again to simulate it, it uh, to be fair, it does show a little bit, but it's not going to show what I wanted it to. I'm guessing it's the path that's obstructing it, which is not great. Right, that's fine. Let's have a look at building another one and then. Getting rid of the other one. No, terrain constraints. Oh, there we go. That was too close, though. I don't think the path's going to fit. So that won't work. That's fine. Um, Would that not be better? I think that would be better. That's fine. Um, Let's get rid of that. Yeah, I know. No one knows as much money as I would have if I got it right the first time. This is going to be a little bit better, I feel. Maybe not. Meh. So basically, <laughs> you want that. That's a good cone of vision. And then you want... I'm guessing, like... So. That's a good cone of vision. No, wait. Perfect. And then, we need to build stuff around them, like food and whatnot, so let's go ahead and focus on that quickly. So we want a restaurant. And, okay, so a restaurant first, I guess. Sorry, go blow, come on. I know it's in you. <sighs> Perfect, I think, maybe. Let's, I'm guessing the paths can be able to connect. Yep, cool. All is well. All is well in the world. And then we need a uh, clove shop. I don't think that's going to fit, so we may need to go with a gift shop instead. That kind of sucks. Um, I could maybe shorten this a little bit. That could work, so let's do that, actually. So, fences... I have a couple of these, so we'll get rid of that one. Get, we'll get a little bit of a refund too, actually. I was about to delete the fence before building the next fence. That would have been done. Right. Get rid of this. Get rid of those trees. Check up on our Serratos. Make sure they're okay with the space reduction. They are. Fantastic. And then go to guests and build ourselves a clothes shop. Hopefully. Oh, <sighs> terrain constraints. The worst concept in this game. Whoever thought of it being a possibility should have been fired. There, I said it, and I mean it. Right, let's go ahead and get our dinosaur cured quickly. Oh, wow, it's one of our baryonyxes, aka one of the ones we just got. Um, right. I guess we're going to have to go... Actually, you know what? That's not the worst. I saw it go blue, so that means it can go blue... Right, let's try maybe the clothes shop facing that way. Let's have a look quickly. Yep, that's all right then. All is good. Right. And 
Let's connect a path. Path connected. There we go. Path connected. Come on. Path connected. Fantastic. Now we just need to connect the path from there to there. And get a substation down here. So, substation. I haven't got a large one yet, so we're going to want to put it there. Perfect. Glorious. Right. We're out of power. So, <laughs> what if I put on you? Reduced upkeep. Hmm. Well, let's go ahead and put an outage protection and then improved output. And we have sorted ourselves out for power again. We've got one extra power, which means, yes, we do need to put another power station shortly, and I will. But for now, I'm just happy that everything's functioning, which is grand. Right, I've been ignoring my digs, but that's because I was sorting out mess after mess after mess. So extract. Ugh, I was hoping that would be a Tyrannosaurus Rex one, that would have been perfect. It's a shame that it wasn't. And Tyrannosaurus Rex. So we're at 50%. <laughs> oh dear me, right. Um, I don't know why I'm focusing on the T-Rex just yet, because we should be really going for like the Dynamicus and stuff like that. Help me get my ratings up. Um, but you know, so facilities rating is doing quite well. Nicely, I'm guessing yeah, funds that's dropped. That's fine. I'm gonna go research ourselves the gyrosphere station, and that will give us more visibility and fun. So let's have a quick see look a doodle. Glorious, right? Uh, while I'm here, then I guess we can look at getting a few more of these lovely genomes done. So do that now. Keep ourselves a little bit of a bigger. Um, reserve this time. I'm going to get a third Baryonyx, don't worry, that is part of the goal here, because that will get us probably just before 1.15, and that, that is basically taking off just over half, which is a nightmare. Um, so we do need more variety, so I guess Dynamicus in one, and I'm not going to put Velociraptor in another one, but Trudon, however. Oh, I might need to research Trudon, actually. I think I do. Let's have a look. Fossils. Do, where are we, Judon? There you are. Right, um, yeah, we do need to research it. It's not expensive. Um, and we're going to just wait here for one of those genes to get finished and stick the Trudon in a research. As I said, this video is not going to be super long. It's probably around the 30 minute mark, which is longer than my normal standard conventional episodes. Um, but it's not as long as the 45 minutes in, in my time at Port, for example, hour longs. The reason for that is, is I want to be able to get a chance to do quite a few of these and then get a chance to play some of my time at Portia and then get a chance to edit and get stuff sorted for the next couple of days whilst I'm back on my shifts after a glorious time away in Barcelona. So, extract what I have to, sell what I can't. What, yeah, what I can't. Right. Oh, T-Rex. You're not giving me much here, are you, buddy? However, if we get all of those other ones to 100% bright side, then only T-Rex should show up, right? I think, maybe? I don't know. If not, we can just start selling the rest, which is grand. Quite a nice little reserve going on, which I like. We're going to save the game, because I'm not Dingus. Corex, make up your mind, Billy. I don't know if you guys can see that. I think you can. I don't think you can see when I get an achievement, but I think you might have seen my Steam friends. And if you can, that buddy is not making up his mind and playing like 12 different games at once. Which is a pain. Gyrus Station, Wunderbar, right. That's a massive amount of fun. And conveniently, I can build one there, one there. So oh, we need more power. We do need more power. Right. You, I think they give 100 power. So it's not like they're giving me much more. So for now, we're going to build this. Another medium power station. Quite an amount of money, I must say. But an investment nonetheless. So reduced upkeep all on all three. And then we can change that whenever we need to. That makes that a little bit easier. Yay, Trudons have now been unlocked. Let's go back to research then and go and get more genetic stuff done. So, that works. Don't know what they really do, but uh, I kind of need a nice little variety thrown in there. So, actually, I should have read them. <laughs> but, you know. Right, less than a minute we're raining. We're going to grab the fossils and then send them off again. And I think it's a great place to leave the video once we've done that. 
But let's see, I'm starting to sound a bit more monotone and quiet again, that's sorry, I am very tired. Oh, I can't go back there, that's fine. Oh, I can get start getting my Trodons. Nope, can't get my Trodons until I got my T-Rex. So that I can start thinking of the future, because this is going to be a very, very long playthrough, I can tell. Par time is three. I'm hoping, because I, I think you can still see this part while I'm checking the achievements. I've got, oh, I've only got five more to go. Huh. I have no idea why that is. Um... All oh, right, there's only five of these, I guess. Um, so faster a biped, that's not happening. Uh, what was I looking for? Right, any difficulty, so the essence of chaos. And here we go, complete challenge on painter. So I'm hoping I can do that. And is Par's not going to cancel me out? Otherwise, last few episodes have been wasted. <laughs> but I'm pretty sure you can because I've seen videos where people talk about the fact that it took them um, a while to do so. Um, up to five hours and they still got the achievements. I'm hoping that's the case and part I might not hit part But I should still Hit my five star, you know hit my five stars within an X Y Z or amount of time anyway um, Fossils do they seriously come back that quick? Why wow, I've been talking for that long right So we are going to leave the video here so guys if you have enjoyed today's video Please make sure you do smash the like button if you haven't already make sure to subscribe to my crazy video comments I'd super duper appreciate it. Didn't see a bit of work being done off camera. Do not panic not loads It's just time efficiency I guess um, especially where we're doing only like 30 minute episodes give me a chance to record more and we've got a storm fantastic right let's go ahead and open all showers and anyway thank you all so much for watching have a nice day and ta-ra